Next, I'm going to highlight my brow bone first because Sitika has really highlighted brow bone. She is not having very dramatic eye shadow in the song. It's really simple. I just create a little bit of transition into my crease and then I'll apply a golden shade all over my lips. I'll be using a light brown shade as my transition shade for this look. Next, I'm going to apply a golden eye shadow all over my lips. This is so simple. If you don't have uh, this palette with you, you can use a Maybelline Nudes palette. You can easily create this look using that palette. Now, use the same brush that you used for your crease before and run it all over your crease again. Now we will do our smoky eye look. For that I am using a NYX brown eye pencil. This is a little black but you need just that. And we will apply it as an eyeliner on top of my eyelashes. Now why I am using this brown pencil for the smoky eye look? Because this will create a nice uh, smoky effect when I use black pencil on top of it. The color will just fade from dark to light and it will mix into my golden eyeshadow on my skin. Next, I'm going to use a small brush to smudge the brown eyeshadow edges. Now, the smoky eye which the Pika is carrying in this song is not like extra smoky eye, it's really regular smoky eye. Next, I'm using Maybelline Gel Liner in the shade black for. Lining my upper lid. Then I'm going to use the same brush and smudge the ends of this liner before it dries up. Because that's exactly how her liner looks like in this song. Now moving on to the lower lash part which is very important for this look. So I am going to line the area under my waterline using this brown pencil like I am not going to brown, I am not going to line my lo lower waterline this portion and that I will cover with black gold pencil but I am going to line just beneath that. I am trying my best to explain this. Then I will work harder on explaining things. I know I'm not best with that. Now again, I'm doing this to create a nice transition of smokiness from dark to light. Okay, I just realized the camera was not recording and in the meantime, I just applied this Plum Nature Studio whole pencil on my lower waterline hair and on my upper waterline. And then I use my brush to smudge the lower brown whole pencil. I just use strokes at 45 degrees to smudge my brown whole pencil. Now once I make this done, I am removing that excess finishing powder that we applied before. Next I am going to curl my lash and coat them using mascara. I am using Maybelline Lash Sensational Mascara. Also going to apply some fake lashes. I am using other Demi the Space lashes and I'm going to use our lash Now we'll move on to the contouring which is the most important part because Deepika has really sharp features. So I'm going to use makeup to get that sharp look. So I'm using LA Girl Pro Conceal in the shade Beautiful Brown. I like to contour along with my foundation but when I started I thought that I'll be doing powder then I changed my mind. I don't think her forehead is contoured but I'll contour mine a little bit because I have like brown face. Now I'll contour my jawline. Now I'm going to set my liquid contour using powder contour. I'm using my makeup revolution at the contour palette. Yeah. 
Now to make my contour even more sharp, I am using this banana shaped powder from the same palette. This will make my contour more sharp. I'm going to contour my nose because she has like the sharpest nose. So I'm going to use powder contour for that and a flat shaped brush. First of all, I will draw a line alongside my bridge of my nose. I will draw a semi circle here. Like now I'm going to use the same brush and bring the contour shape down. Then I'm going to use my ring finger, just smudge it nicely. Next I'm going to use another brush and apply some highlighter on the of my nose that will slip my nose even more. Once done, I'm going to use my Nicer Sisters palette and I'll be using this um, golden berry with nicer shade from this and I'll apply it on to the high points of my face. Nice golden highlighter. Next, I'm going to use this L'Oreal Paris to match blush. Moving on to the lips, Dipika is wearing really nice new pinkish lipstick on her lips, and it's not completely matte. So I am first going to apply this Smudge Me Not lipstick by Sugar in the shade 16. This dries out to a matte finish, so I'll be adding a little gloss on top of it. I'll be using every way out there plumping lip gloss. And then to set everything, I'm going to use my MAC Prep and Prime. I'll also add this Freedom Pro lipstick in the shade Naked Tilt on top of my lipstick because I want to fold it down a little bit. This is the complete look. I really like how it turned out to be. This is so fabulous. And if you're wondering, I have DMI this body chain. You can watch the whole tutorial here, and I'll also link it down in the description box below. So thank you so much for watching this video. I really hope you enjoyed watching it, and it was useful for you in any way. If you enjoyed watching this video, please hit that like button. It would mean a lot to me. And if you're new to my channel, hi. Please subscribe to my channel so that we can stay connected.